forward. Love will tell you, I dare you to cross that line. Love is desire. Jason, I am trying to love you. But I don't want my heart broken. Love is understanding. Hey, man. Did you get help? You know, you just say the word. Love is struggle. Can't you do right? Like you? It's my family. They need me. No, I need you. But above all, love is quiet in a world full of thunder. You keep trying to save a brother that don't want to be saved. Action! Bob Sandy is what? Cease fire! Gramercy Pictures presents Jason's Lyric, a new film by George Jackson and Doug McHenry. Starring Alan Payne, Jada Pinkett, Forrest Whitaker, Bokeem Woodbine, Tretch, and Eddie Griffin. So let's break down. You love the story. Cut. Jason's lyric is a love story, and love on many different levels. It's about the love between two brothers, and how one brother has been kind of trapped and carried the other brother on his back emotionally like an anvil. Well, you need to get serious and get you a job. I'm looking, man. I circled a couple of here to help you out. Jason had taken on the responsibility of his uh, mother and his brother. Then he meets this girl that opens him up to love. I never flown in a plane before. Sometimes you don't need a plane to fly. Sell TVs. Lyric is a very lyrical character. You know what I mean? She has an appreciation for a calm stream. Jason is a dreamer himself. He has a lot of magic that he has forgotten that he has, and Lyric just reminds him. Damn, it's quiet out here. Should have bought my radio. No, it's not quiet. It's full of music. Just listen. Lyric all her life has been looking for someone to pour herself into completely. Someone she can pour all her love into and just love unconditionally. So, Miss Girl, what's going on with your love life? Give up the 411. You washed my feet. What? I just saw for a nigga to wash these feet. Joshua is upset now because this girl is distracted. His older brother, he's definitely jealous of the relationship that his older brother has with Lyric. What's your name, buddy? Lyric. Hey. This is my brother, Josh. It's a beautiful night. If his older brother's not there to clean up after him, where does that leave him? Me and Lyric, we just think about just getting on the bus, just going. We're just gonna go. Jason wants to go, but he's torn with his love and the responsibility for his mother and his brother. Jason, something I need to tell you about your brother. My brother? For me, you could be making three G's in one night. I'm listening. He's gonna rob a bank tomorrow with my brother and his crew. Joshua wants to come off with the big heist. He wants to make the great escape, perpetrate the great train robbery. He wants to be like a pawn. Now let's get down to business. I'm ready to get paid. Look, I'm the chief, and you the Indian. And I mean, ain't nobody getting paid till I say so. Alonzo is the bad guy. He's the gangster from the war. Don't cross Alonzo. I'm just gonna talk to Josh. You think I'm not stupid? You know what, man? I ain't in no hurry to go back to that cage. Jason desperately wants to connect with Joshua, you know? I mean, desperately wants to. He just doesn't seem to be able to find out the right way to do it. I know no one else around here believes in me, but I always thought when it came down to it, you would. This is for my brother. Ah! Ah! Got in the middle, didn't you? Sometimes heroes have to walk away. 
walk away, Jason. We can't be together. While I am my brother's keeper, I'm ultimately not responsible for my brother's life. That is the, the primary lesson that Jason learns with the help of Lyric. What makes this movie so different is that it is a love story between two young black adults who love very passionately, who love very tenderly, who love very intensely. Love is a lot more than what people perceive it to be. Maybe after this film, people will have a new definition of what it is. The wards ain't full of Jasons, but your family was quiet. You were full of thunder.